into battle, my valiant steed! <laughs> <laughs> and we're back once again, and I'm repping the Canterbury Christ Church University jumper, and my hair looks like ass. So, as usual, it's a great day. Really easy to see now, so no one can say. And we have been saucy milk knives. Work here for lunch. Yes. I've realised in a lot of these videos, I do a lot of weird different voices, but it seems to be in people can people laugh, so. <laughs> it looks like I'll be keeping it. It's great! Mmm! You cannot beat the Lucas Aid on a boiling ass hot day like today. But I really mean boiling. It's roasting. Where's the sun? Oh, there it is. Oh, focus. There we go. It's literally boiling. I don't know what that means. And that was three hours well spent doing a spot of shopping with the girlfriend. Now to go home and do nothing. Um, no, what we're going to do, we're going to go see Rob and see what he's up to. And hopefully, hopefully go out and do something to make this a little bit more interesting and for you guys. But yeah, obviously we'll have to wait and see and hopefully there might be time lapses and things like that. But I don't know yet, so... A couple of lads doing a spot of fishing. How interesting. So once again we find ourselves on the way down to Rob's and I've got an idea. We are going to try and scare Rob. So the plan is get down to Rob's before he comes back and then what we do we try and scare him but we have to get to his before he gets home from work so that we can successfully scare him in the perfect way. I kind of feel like I'm going to be caught out here. I don't know, we'll have to wait and see. But yeah, I'm gonna set up this camera here um, in his house and we're gonna see if we can make him jump. Like these ones here. I absolutely love the design of them. But, you know, I don't have the money yet, so we'll have to wait and see. I didn't realize was, when I was filming that last clip, the next door neighbor to the houses was staring at me the whole time I was talking. And it kind of looked to me like I was gonna rob the place. I'm not, I'm just taking a photo, so, you know, it, there's, there's nothing to worry about, it's all good, I just, I just want to live there, I don't want to rob them. Successfully beat Rob home, so, now I've just got to get in, and do it before he gets home, so that we can make him jump, out of his skin, and hopefully give him a heart attack. No, don't, because, I don't want that, I don't want to deal with people having heart attacks today, mm -mm. Oh shit, oh shit. We good. He not here yet. Huh? To be honest, I thought he had just pulled up in the drive. I may have just shit myself. But no, we've got a little bit more time to find a hiding space to then scare the shit out of him. So yeah, you're gonna be up here and I'm gonna hide down there and he's gonna come through and boom. But for now, he's not here, so you know, kinda, but no. Still waiting. How long does it take to drive? Like, for real? Uh, I feel like this is him. Okay, now this is definitely him pulling up now. <laughs> yeah. Only I, in typical me fashion, would decide at half seven at night that I want to put up a swimming pool. Yeah, that's happening. That, that, for real. Um, so yeah, I'm going to spend the next couple of hours putting up a swimming pool in Rob's garden. Because mine is a currently a construction site. Mm -hmm. So yeah, that's going to be interesting. And hopefully, we will have a proper um, swimming pool. This thing is literally 
one hell of a pain in the ass. It's so flimsy that it actually just like, it's really hard to carry so because it just keeps bending and it's just like, oh, nice, smooth. And I'm nearly at my destination. And currently, my arm is feeling like shit. It literally hurts to carry this. It's so bad. It's a pain in the ass, but you know, it's kind of, what is up on my face? Hello. There we go. Um, yeah, it's a little bit on the painful side to carry. So yes, I'm gonna stop vlogging now and carry this properly. Side note on the other hand, it is beautiful outside and it's absolutely boiling still. It's at least 26 degrees, which for England is very, very hot. So yeah, keep it up England, you're doing good, doing great, doing absolutely fantastic. Ah. Sorted. I sort of business, fix my hand because it feels a little bit tingly. No, first order of business, music. Uh, and I find myself a bumblebee. It's great. To be honest though, I probably shouldn't get too close because I'm actually allergic to these things. So, I'm gonna be staying away from you. I know there is a pump in here somewhere. Where, I don't know, but I'm sure I'll find it. Also, that last clip, that was a yawn, but I think I just got a little bit loopy. So, yeah. Um, I can't find this pump. As you saw from the uh, time lapse, so yeah, pretty much. That's uh, that's all set up now to go get the hose, move that into there, and fill that up. And so the wait begins. It's filling up, and I have to wait a couple of hours now. Oh well, I can enjoy a nice, refreshing cider. Mmm, tasty. The pool is filling right here, and we have Wally the walrus over here, keeping an eye over it, so as soon as he starts floating, should be good, should be set, ready to go. Wally, I'm counting on you. Meanwhile, we have our fire pit over here, and I'm going to set that up, ready to go, and... Yeah. I'm gonna get that done so that we can uh, have a nice little fire. Sitting in that chair, listening to some music. Currently I've got Coldplay playing, but it's kind of like mm, monkeys in the background. Meanwhile, before I get a cop copyright strike, I'm gonna turn this off and yeah. Dad, dad right there, mothering. I'm pretty proud. It's burning away, so that's a good sign. Um, I just walked out that door, I come out here, and that is hissing, and that noise, that's rain. I think I realised why, oh, yeah, I now know why it was hissing, it is the rain. And that is going to go out, and I couldn't really care. Because it is coming down pretty hard. And it's like... Ugh. Um, shut this door over here. We good. Um, that could carry on filling. That is kind of going to have to leave that one. I don't really know what to do other than that. Oh, my lord. I mean, I don't know if it shows. Uh, yeah, it shows a little bit. Wally's like, yo, what's it to you? Um, it shows a little bit, but it is coming down. Uh, yeah. Well, the fire pit kind of went out the window and... Wally's just floating away. That's fine, that can get filled, but that, 
I don't really know what to do. Oh, I apologise in advance. I am going to be having a toasty. I'm going to be having a toasty, so I will clean my mess. Don't you worry. But yeah, I've I've got a I've got a pretty pretty good setup. I approve, and then you go, George Foreman, for my toasty. Oh, uh, let's look damn tasty. Mm -mm. It's like a burger. I wish you guys could smell it through this thing, but one more minute, one more minute, and then you'll be in my stomach. I am going to get a time lapse of this because I've just looked out the window and it is such a damn beautiful view and I'm going to time lapse that. Oh my god, look. Look at that. I'm going to time lapse that because that's pretty hella fancy. Good sign when you see Wally, Wally the Morris. Flowing around in the pool, just trying to fill. It's kind of a good sign. It means it's got a little bit of water. How the hell this is still burning? It's been like raining for the past 10 minutes. Like, how is it still burning? I don't get it. The good people that we are. Me being me and you. Yes, me and you. Me and you, the viewers. We're going to go check on Wally. See how he's getting on. Wally, how's it going? You got a couple of inches of water? Mm, yeah. Still got quite a bit to go, but you know, keep it up. Keep floating. Just this is still going. It's kind of. It's going. Oh, I'm watching you. You've been warned. You have been warned. Basically, what's going to happen is Rob is going to be jumping in the pool and it is about 9 o'clock at night. Yeah, about 9 o'clock at night. Rob's going to be jumping in the pool and I'm going to try and get it on slow-mo and hopefully it should be pretty funny. Um, just finished running, so, you know, it'd be quite nice. It'd be quite re refreshing at this time of night. I don't think it will be. Unfortunately though guys, that is the end of today's vlog, so yeah, as always, hope you enjoy, like, subscribe, and come back next time, and leave a like down below, leave any comments, concerns, anything like that in the section below as well, um, and if you do have any problems, feel free to message me, uh, go on to my Twitter, follow me on there, um, follow my girlfriend's Instagram at Sophie Louise Photos. <laughs> Um, find me on Instagram at, at s underscore Clark and then yeah if you do have anything or need anything at any point feel free to comment below and yeah as always guys hope you enjoy and see my face next time